Hello, good afternoon. Uh, this is just a quick haul showing a few of the items I found at the Goodwill in Dorcas. I'm going to start with Goodwill first. I didn't find a whole lot, but I really like what I found. I love this pottery. I guess it's some type of um, platter. Love the colors on it. And then it has a signature on the back, and I really could not figure out the lettering. This little, I don't know why I always pick these up, but this little September bank by Precious Moments. And I think, like I said, it wasn't a ton. Um, this here, it's a um, willow tree. It's a music box. And what else did I find at Goodwill? At Goodwill, also these mugs, I found four of these, and they are made in Japan. Have, ooh, ready to have three. So I found four of those, and I think that was all I got at Goodwill. Oh, I got these two things at Goodwill, too. I forgot about these here. Just some um, Day Springs uh, greeting cards, but they I like the little puppies and kittens that's on them. They're really cute. And for Micah, since this is his first Christmas, it's a no uh, mess. The baby's feet never touch ink, and it has a thing for the uh, hand and footprint, and it says baby's first Christmas, and I liked it because it didn't have a year on it. So I'm excited to try that. Or you can put, and it said plus you can put a photo on the back. Huh. So that was just 99 cents, so. Oh, and at Goodwill too, I forgot, I did get um, this here. I'll put this in my booth. This is the Big Ten came from some, yep, came from Hobby Lobby. I kind of thought that. But it's a pretty good size. Okay. Then the next store I went into was Dorcas. Yeah, I went into Dorcas, which I love Dorcas. It's like my favorite. And it's in, um, where is it at? It's in Cary, North Carolina. I had a doctor's appointment and everything went really good. I don't have to go back for two years to the heart doctor. But I spent $61, but you're not going to believe all the stuff that I got. I'm going to start with these here. I'm really not sure. I got them because they were 50 cents. Let's be real. But they're glass. And I'm quite sure I can do something with these. So I bought four of these. They had a ton of them. If it had been in, if I was still living in Atlanta, I would have gotten a lot of them and I would have done a class with those. Then I got these color forms, Raggedy Ann, and I think it said 1967. They're the color forms and all of them are in there. Got quite a few clothes and everything in it and the stand to help her, you know, it's just really nice. So that was only 50 cents. Okay, what else did I get? I got so much stuff there. This baby bank here. Look at that face. And it is by Lego. So got that. It's just so much I got. And they had so many things today for 50 cents. This wasn't 50 cent, but I, it's a, a, a set of these. It's the, they kind of look, remind you of Beatrice Potter. They're not, I don't know if they're, I don't think they were homemade, handmade or whatever, but, cause it did have a tag at one time, but I just thought they were really cute. I love the soft pastel colors. I gotta speed it up cause it's so much stuff. This beautiful teacup. Really nice. Set that back there. I haven't unboxed this stuff yet because if I do that, once I do that and put it up, then it's up. This November little girl um, says November. Only thing is a few of the little petals are missing off of her flower. But it was like 50 cents, so you know. What else? What else? Oh, I got this. Let me open, get this by the newspaper, though. I don't want to drop any of these. 
It's a smaller one, but it's one of the Christmas trees. It has a lot of the, um, and this was a hobbyist project. And it has a lot of, of the um, ornaments have fallen off, but I'll put those back on. But believe it or not, this was a dollar. Okay, so we got that. This just fell out. This is a miniature uh, set of decanter and four goblets and a little platter like for, I guess it said dollhouse when I looked it up on eBay. And that set sells for about $13.95 on eBay. And you can see what I paid there. Oh, this is pretty. Look at this. Really nice. I don't know anything about it. I just love that crackle effect that it had in this rose-like color. Okay. Bought this for me. I always pick up hummingbird feeders whenever I see them, and this one is glass. It has a little perch and everything for them. So that. Oh. I probably should have unwrapped the stuff before I got started, but I didn't. And I think, no, I didn't. A little March girl. They had quite a few elephants. Look at this. It's like marble or something, but it's hand painted really nice. I haven't looked this one up, but I just thought that was really nice. Plus, I got some other smaller ones. This here is like a little uh, wall plaque or a trivet with a road runner on it. I thought the painting was nice on it. You have the cork back. Another one of those little elephants with this one has red on. So that was really, um, I thought those were nice finds. This one says best friends. It's a little uh, stained glass angel and it has a little candle, hold a tea light candle on the back. At least that's what I think it's for. See what this one is. Oh, this was cute. I'm quite sure she was holding an umbrella. But look at her face. Ooh, I'm the wrong side. Look at that hat. I have a poodle with this same kind of hat on. And that was that was a whole two dollars. So that one, you know, paid a little bit more. Look at this little chipmunk. And I believe this is some type of resin or something. It has the original tag is up under the price. Got these bags. I think that's what these are. It said bags. It doesn't say anything else about them. But it looked like it was quite a few. And I thought this would be something good I could put my dolls in. Yeah. And it is one, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight, not ten bags. Oh, they're different sizes. Anyway, they were a dollar. So ten cent a bag, you can't beat that. I'll just pick this up like this. I always buy these. I just think they're cute, but you know, they're not like a really good seller, but and I bought this right here. I was thinking about Jody Renshaw. I was thinking she could use this in some of her photography. So Jody, if you're watching, let me know. But look how cute it says Guatemala on it. But this just looks like something she would use in her photography. Another little, um, this one is a donkey. It's marble, made in Mexico. A hand carved little seal or sea lion. I think it's actually two of those, if I'm not mistaken. Look at the face on her. Isn't that just so cute? So, so cute. Look at the face. And, of course, a few of her little petals are broken, but it was 50 cent, too. So, had to get that. I love the face on her. 
Then I, this right here is a set of three. I'm not sure of what they're for, but it's this, I love the painting on them. And then the other one is an orange color. So that was a set of three. And then also they had this one here. And this one is on like its own little stand. And another one of the little hand carved. I think this one might be a dolphin. But it's a real nice, rich color wood. What else is in? Oh, I know what this big thing is. Oh. Look at this, a Thomas the Train piggy bank. Still has the stopper and everything. So that's pretty big. It's as big as my head, so it's that was big. But I'm not done yet. Just wait. This is my find. This is what I think I got most excited about. Well, let me I gotta move this out of the way first, so I'll show you this first. This really nice Tonka fire truck. It's a big one, but it was two dollars. But that wasn't what my excitement was. My excitement was for these. Why are you stuck, dress? These little vintage dresses, they're all, most of them are size 2T with the crystal pleating. This one was by um, J.C. Penney's, yeah, Tyler Time. This was a 3T, they're twos and 3Ts. That one. This one, and this one is by, who's this one by? Mini World. Look at this one. This is the dress in the little pinafore. I think somebody probably had a shop and closed their shop because they all had these little tags on them. This pink one here. Love smocking. This one had smocking on it. This one was a brand that I had never heard of. I think it was made for Sears and Roebuck probably, but it was Winnie the Pooh brand. Which I hadn't heard of that brand, but evidently they're quite popular because they have a lot of Winnie the Pooh. This one here. And this one was a size six, and it's by Rare Editions, which a lot of stores sell that brand. And then this cute little um, nautical style sailor dress. That. I'm getting to the end now. We got these horses, but I didn't look them up or anything, but this bag was $1.50. Got this one here. Just glance and see if I've seen the name. But they're well, very well made horses. This one here. Uh, I do see a name, but I can't read it. That one. And this last one, this little brown one here with a broken leg. Hmm. Didn't realize that, but it was a dollar fifty, which I would have paid for one. Uh, some, this is vinyl. I didn't read that good. I just seen Heat and Bond. Anyways, vinyl Heat and Bond. Yeah, I'll be trying to rush when I'm in the store sometimes because like today my husband was with me and I hate him just sitting out in the car. This little wooden hand-painted box. I'm, I don't know if the top comes off. I tried in the store. I couldn't get it off, but I shall see what else is down in this box. This is weird, but it was 50 cents, so I got it anyway. But it's rubber. It's like a child's toy, kind of. I guess it was a squeaker toy, but a child would be scared of that. This is a card tray, a revolving card tra uh, tray for playing cards. These little sand cast dogs, including their little basket. There's a little beagle, it looks like. And the other one is some type of, just like a poodle type dog. That, I'm getting to the end, I promise. 
And I have two of these. They're just napkins, but it said a woman always lands on her feet. And I'm going to use these here. Um, they're cookie cutters by Wilton, Christmas ones. I'm going to use these for a craft. It's nine of them in there, and they were $1.50, but I liked them especially because they were colors. So I'm going to use those for a craft. I haven't looked those up yet, but look at these. They're Coca-Cola Christmas ornaments. It's a set of five. So I have to look that up. This, I don't know what it is, but it was like, how much was this? It was a dollar. And in my booth, I'm going to be setting up um, like a toy section for Christmas. This one I bought because I could see several pairs in it. One, two, three, four, at least five pairs in and they look older. Plus a couple little ornaments and stuff. And their bags was $2 for their bags like that. This bag here was another $2 bag. It has some of the action figures in it. So that's a booth item as well. Oh, and the last thing is this set of deck of cards here. I mean, deck of cards. <laughs> Paper napkins, look at that. But isn't that cute? I bought those with a friend Brenda in mind. So that was my haul. Like I said, I was very pleased. I felt like, oh wow, I finally found some stuff. And so you'll be seeing some of these things in upcoming sales. But thanks for watching. And uh, give us a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. Um, what else? And I'll be on tonight, if you're watching this today, it's Tuesday, because I come on, I have live sales most Tuesdays or um, tutorials, and Saturday I have a sale. And this week on the, let me see, the 30th on my channel, I'll have Nebby Powell as my guest um, in our sale, and then I'm going to be on with Carrie T on this Thursday. Something else I want to show you, another one of the things I love. I picked these flowers out of my garden. Some of them are starting to wilt a little. I picked them three days ago now. Yeah. But these are some of the things. I have roses and snapdragons and mums and ferns. And I just discovered a new patch with lots of ferns. I've just growing up under my she shed. So, again, thanks. And please, give me a thumbs up if you like this type of content. And also, join me for some of my live sales. And subscribe if you haven't. Thanks. Bye-bye. See you later.